Welcome to Q Cars channel. Spy shots reveal a refreshed version of Kia's flagship SUV, the Sorento though it won't hit showroom floors until early in 2024. Given that South Korean manufacturers have become accustomed to decreasing the durability of their products in recent years, this may not come as much of a surprise. Kia, Hyundai, and Genesis do more than just renew their product lines mid-cycle and switch generations to stay competitive. The 2024 Sorento's front fascia is completely new. It's more daring and, in a good way, futuristic. Traditional rectangular horizontal headlights perched atop running lights have been replaced by vertical headlights, together with slim running lights to form a T. The Kia emblem used to be situated in the middle of the grille, however it was recently moved to the underside of the hood. Body color trim totally separates the bigger grille from the headlights. The bumper is also the skid plate, and there are two large vertical air intakes directly under the headlights. There will be minor changes to the taillights. Even though Kia hasn't announced anything, we can probably expect the updated Sorento to debut sometime in the second half of 2023. If that's the case, we might see it in 2024 as a 2024 model. The revised Sorento will debut in South Korea in 2023, and then it will likely roll out to the rest of the world in the early months of 2024. In the United States, Kia will introduce the Sorento S in December 2024 with a price range of $33,500 to $44,900. On the inside, the digital gauge cluster and primary infotainment system have been replaced by a new set of screens. Newer Kia infotainment software appears to be powering the central display, and the digital instrument cluster appears to be larger than the unit used in the current Sorento's upper trim levels. A touch bar, like those found in the Sportage and the EV6, is located lower on the dashboard and can be used to toggle between the climate control and the navigation system. The 2024 Sorento is likely to carry over the same powertrain selection as the current generation. Available to buyers in the USA is a 2.5-liter inline-four that generates 191 horsepower, 142 kilowatts, and 182 pound-feet of torque, 246 newton-meters. One can alternatively choose the 281 horsepower, 210 kilowatts, output of the 2.5-liter turbocharged engine or the 311 pounds to foot, 421 newton-meters, of torque from the manual transmission. Kia offers two different hybrid drivetrains for the Sorento. A four-cylinder engine producing 227 horsepower, 169 kilowatts, and 258 pounds to foot, 350 newton meters, of torque comes as standard equipment. The plug-in hybrid has a 1.6-liter engine with 261 horsepower, 195 kilowatts, and 258 pounds to foot of torque. The updated version of the car should come with those motor choices. We do not expect any substantial modifications, although it is likely that Kia may become somewhat more efficient. Thanks for watching.